Hello everyone and welcome back to the Rain Factory. This is the video number 14 of a list of video tutorials where I show you how I make terrain pieces and other elements for your tabletop slash RPG games. In this video I'm going to make a small mausoleum surrounded by a little graveyard complete with some gravestones and a path that leads to it. All we need to make this is something for the base I'm using a 30 by 30 cm piece of MDF, some styrofoam for the different bricks, and some cardboard for the base structure. Let's get to it. The first thing we're going to do is the base structure. So, using the cardboard, measure and cut 4 pieces for the walls. For reference, mine are 10 by 10 by 9. A little tip, if you're using cardboard that has a more smooth plasticky side, don't make the same mistake I made and be mindful to put that side on the inside because it's kinda harder to paint on that. Next, let's cut all the foam we need. We'll need two different sizes of bricks. A larger one for the bottom and the top layer and a smaller one for the middle ones. Using different bricks will add a little bit of variety to the structure and make it more interesting. Also, we're making all the bricks fairly large because I find that using larger bricks makes the building a little bit more elegant compared to the ones made with tiny bricks. And also we need to cut a lot less of them. For the roof, take a few pieces of foam as long as the mausoleum and cut them diagonally, gluing them on top of each other. Once we are done cutting all the pieces, we can glue them on the base structure. Remember to leave some space for the door. Once everything is glued together, we can decorate a bit as we like and work on the door. To make that, cut a hole in the cardboard and use the cutout as a base structure on top of which we are going to glue some thin pieces of wood. After that, the mausoleum is done and we can work on the base. Mark approximately where your mausoleum is going to be and then, using the styrofoam, Cut some tiny bricks to make the path that leads to it. Then, using some foam scraps, we can make a few gravestones. Next, prepare a mix of flour, PBA glue, and water until you get something that is fairly thick and spread it all over the base, placing the mausoleum in the middle of it. Then, 
make another batch of the same mix, making it more thin this time, to cover and protect all the foam. You can add some paint to this, to make it easier for yourself to see where you have already painted. Once everything is covered and dried, we can prime it black and then start painting. First, apply a coat of light grey to the mausoleum, the path and the gravestones. Then, cover the ground around it with brown paint. Then, apply a black wash made from black paint, water and a couple of drops of dish soap to everything, removing any excess with some paper towel. Next, overbrush everything made with stone with the same light grey we used for the base coat. and the ground with a few layers of progressively lighter browns. After that, the paint job is done and all we have left is to add some grass to this. For this build, I'm going for a more patchy grass. So, after sprinkling a base layer of grass, covering everything, I'm just going to put some bigger chunks here and there. Once the glue has dried, our build is done and our graveyard is complete.
I hope you liked this video and found it useful. Thank you for coming to my channel. See you in the next one. And remember, keep playing with your maps.